An airy man says it all started with one military patch decades ago. That one patch soon turning into two, then three, and years later, well, the collection has grown to jaw-dropping numbers. David Belmondo has our story. Jack Dana is a collector, a collector of military patches, lots and lots of military patches. The total on, uh, showing on right now is uh, 1,350 patches. Jack started collecting these patches as a teenager. He went to an Army surplus store and bought one, and that turned into nearly 1,400. At first, Jack kept those patches neatly in a shoebox, but then thought... And I thought, well, you can't show anybody up here uh, in shoeboxes. So Jack and his daughter began the daunting task of sewing each patch onto a sheet for easy display. Jack served 24 years in the Army, retiring as a lieutenant colonel. He knows his patches. Over the years, this is what I kept collecting. And now we have, if you start with the Second World War, those are the Army groups. Then you have your armies. Then you have your corps. And here down to this level here are the divisions of the, that fought in the Second World War. Signal Corps, medical patches, engineers, military police, and aviation. Jack proudly displays them all. And over here you have the different uh, groups like this is the intelligence group. Uh, these are uh, armor or cavalry patches. One of Jack's favorite patches is this one. It's from a kid in his neighborhood that Jack watched grow up. He joined the Marines and he got to serve at Camp David and on a military uh, helicopter for the president. Jack says he often thinks about the men and women who proudly wore those patches while serving our country. David Belmondo, Jet 24, Action News.